Nerd AI is a powerful educational tool designed to assist students with their homework, particularly in subjects like mathematics and writing. Whether you are struggling to solve a tricky math problem or, or you need help crafting a perfect essay, Nerd has got you covered. In this video, we will explore Nerd AI, how it works, and then we'll walk around through how it is being, uh, how you can get, uh, download and install it on your mobile app. And I'll walk you through some of its most useful features, like handling tasks, writing essays, summarizing concepts and ideas, and even writing scripts for videos. We'll also provide a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to use this amazing app uh, to make your studies easier and more efficient. So get ready to transform your learning experience with NetAI. So without taking much of our time, let's get started. So to start with, let me show you how to download and install Nerd AI on your mobile phone. So you can come all the way to your Play Store and just click on it and then you can directly go to the search bar and just search for Nerd AI or just like so and hit on enter or hit on search and you can see it over here, Nerd AI, Nerd AI Tutor and Math Help. Okay, right now I've installed mine but then you can follow through and just install the process is the same you can just go ahead and install on your mobile phone so since i've installed you just follow the process just like the, the way you normally install apps on your mobile phone so i can just go ahead and click on open to kick start it so this is not ai and this is the platform now what you can see here is it has the three different features you can have math that you can just navigate to wherever you have this is the scan and solve so you can scan any mathematical equation or any math problem and you can solve it directly this is the first one scan and solve uh, you can do math you can do general questions you can scan and solve text you can scan and translate text as well so depending on which one you want to start now again you have the ai tutor where you can chat with the ai chatbot directly you can put in your chat over here you can even send in voice message or you can uh, scan a document or snap a document and send it to it and then you can chat about that document. It's very, very sensitive. Now, another way you can use it is you can check out the history of what you have done with it so far. You can see everything that I've done with it so far in terms of calculations and other functions that I've asked it to try for me. Then you have the tasks, which is one of the most important parts of using that AI. Over here, you can search for anything. And then you have draft of things. Is a, you can write essays, blog, articles, scripts, poems, and so on. You name it. Even YouTube scripts, script you can directly write using this feature. And then you have the improve, which you can simplify and shorten or expand things directly. You can paraphrase. You can simplify equations. You can continue writing or shorten something. And then you have the summarize where you can summarize a text, you can summarize a book, you can extract keywords from a given uh, write up or the about. And then down here you have the language translator, you can translate and you can check grammar directly. These are very important features. And down here you can ask questions directly, you can explain, you, know, you can ask it to explain basic things, even trivial topics you can ask. And then you have the code analyzer. You can analyze a code. You can check it and you can optimize a given code however you want it. So let's start with the most basic thing, which is scan and solve. I kind of like it very, very well because of its power when it comes to solving mathematical problems. So let's say I have this math problem that I want it to solve for me. So I can just go ahead and directly scan it. So this is it, 6 plus 6 divided by 2 into one plus two, you can just scan. So I think it has just scanned and I think you can crop only the one question that you want. You can crop it directly using this feature. You can select to make sure you crop the exact point where you have the question. Now, if everything is okay, you can hit on this and then you can see it is scanning and it's going to solve this problem directly and very, very fast. All right, so right now it has picked that this is the equation, this is the problem, and let's tackle this using the BODMAS or PEM, PEMDAS uh, rule. You can see they've explained the acronyms, what, uh, what BODMAS is and what PEMDAS means. In short, you can see the definition over here. 
and then first we need to solve the expressions inside the parentheses which is 1 plus 2 which is equal to 3 now the multiplication division you can see it has solved everything and it has given you that therefore the solution to the problem is 9 which is very very correct so you can see the procedure and how it solves it pretty fast and you can ask anything from here you can write your message here you can ask it to simplify something or to make something very simple for you or you can add further question in case if you want to add something or remove something so this one way let's go back and solve another a bit complex problem all right i think this one also is very very a bit tough so let's try to see how we can solve this all right so right now it is thinking and it has picked the equation exactly as it is so you can see how fast it has solved it you can see it has given us the word problem it has solved it let's break down this problem step by step so it has solved the numerator or the ex uh, the exponents you can see consider step one the base and then solve the base and then solve the base step two step three check the check for extraneous solutions and then you can see how complex the mathematical problem is but it solves it and then at the end it got the the solution to the equation of this uh x equals to two x equals to five and x equals to six which is very very nice and perfect so you can see how powerful and wonderful this app can be. So this is about solving problems directly using mathematical equations. You can as well solve problems that involve what problem. Maybe you can add in, ask some what problem and directly it's going to solve it for you. So let's try something simple and then let's see whether it can be able to solve it for us directly. All right, so, all right, so let's use um, this feature to see how we can translate something from Spanish to English. So let's move this to translate and then let's have this scan this. All right. So let's now a bit set it up to the place where we are interested in. We are just interested in this part. Let it just help us to scan this part. All right. So let's say this is okay. All right. So it has picked the English. You can see directly. It has picked the directly. It has picked it. So you can see the translation. The language is English. And then it has translated um, the NAD artificial AI artificial intelligence an educational tool that facilitates learning in mathematics and writing. So this is very powerful of the software of the application. You can just go ahead and give it a try and see how you can use it to your own advantage. So this is general. This is translate. You can ask general questions as well using this and you can just easily scan and chat with it directly if you're interested. So this is the first part. Scan and solve. Let's try AI tutor. You can see. Let's ask you some questions. What is 21 factorial, for example? What is 21 factorial? All right. So this is a basic question, mathematical question. It's going to solve it, telling you the steps you need to take to solve the problem. You can see it has given you the answer directly. Now, it's, it, comp uh, it compromises everything. It includes everything. So let's tackle this problem step by step. To find 21 factorial, we need to multiply all the numbers from 1 to 21. That's why it is shown. And it has shown you the breakdown 1 times 2 up to the last one. So this is the 21 factorial. This is the answer. And it's very correct. So you can ask more questions like, can you explain the Pythagoras theorem? Yeah. Can you explain the Pythagoras theorem? And you, you're going to see it's going to do it for you pretty fast so you can see of course Pythagoras theorem says that in a right angle triangle the square of the length this is this it has given you all the details you need including the the formula okay this is very very interesting i think this is very very helpful it's going to be a revolutionary innovation in terms of math problem or education or the for the use of for students directly this is very very useful so this is the chat bot you can chat and you can ask more questions, be very specific about it, and it's going to give you your answers accordingly. So let's go back and try one more thing. Let's try the tasks and let's go on and try something like, uh, you can write simple AC. You can be as descriptive as you want. For example, an essay about chat GPT, they make it 1000 words. You can just go ahead and click on generate to start generating. So it does understand that the essay type is analytical and the language is English. And you can see it has given you 1,000 words. Introduction, ChatGPT is an AI model developed by OpenAI and has been making webs in the field of artificial intelligence. So you can see main body and you can see 
it has given you up to 1000 words and look at the timing very very fast you can see in conclusion ChatGPT represents a significant milestone in the field of artificial intelligence so very very nice and pretty interesting you can chat it directly from here what's your message here and you can start this if you're interested let's go back and do something else you can write the essay and you can write script for example i want to make a youtube video about 10 ai tools that i like that that can be useful to creators so i can say write a youtube script about 10 ai tools tools for creators about 10 ai tools for creators so you can just go ahead you can be specific about the target audience business you can be specific about the language basic you can also add other parameters if you're interested so you can just go ahead and click on generate and within some seconds this is going to generate the 10 ai tools for creators and it's going to be very descriptive about it in this same um, application so you can see right now it has given you the 10 the introductory part the title and then this is um introductory this is slide two content creation with ai in general the content brain the canva lumen 5 grammarly bosomo what tune so far is you and so on so much so many of them you can see in conclusion you can even have a slide about q and a this can be very very descriptive all right so you can see this is the what tune the so far is you and so on these are very important and interesting ai tools that uh, creators can need to enhance their experience while creating content okay you can just go ahead and explore so that ai actually i find it exceptionally useful and you can just go ahead and try it and see how you can use it to your own advantage it's very useful okay so this concludes this tutorial about how to use net ai to solve mathematical problems even what problems or sometimes or other issues or ask questions or, so, or write scripts and so on there's so much you can do so please just go ahead and explore and see what you can do with it because it's going to help you to enhance your experiences in learning in general so i hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching and see you in the next one please don't forget to always hit the like and subscribe buttons to keep enjoying videos like this and i will see you in the next one bye